and I would have an opportunity to fuck as many women as I want to, I would do it. I said and Farkas once said I should shut down my channel because my videos suck. Well, go ahead Farkas one. You can fuck yourself before I shut my channel down. That's right, there I am, running a Marine Corps Marathon, October 28, 2012, 26.2 miles, it's me running in front of the Capitol of Washington, D.C., finish time 5, 35, 15, which isn't bad, I mean, I'm no Olympian, but you know what? <coughs> Let's see you guys go out there and run a marathon. Double malt. Double malt. As you can tell, I've already started. <sighs> Malt liquor. Absolutely delicious. Now that guy at the beginning of the video, tell him Farkles to go fuck himself. <laughs> I don't roll like that, man. I don't fuck myself. I may rub one out every once in a while, but I don't fuck myself. He's a little upset because he thinks he made up the saying, serious malt liquor business. When the fact of the matter is, I made up serious malt liquor business, I patented it, I fucking own it, and the only ones that are allowed to say it is me, Odeed, and every other motherfucker who drinks malt liquor. Not the rules. You fucking tool. And you ain't never gonna get uh, laid on the first date. I can bet, well, anything on that. Malt liquor. I saw the video previous to this, the store that I went to, the malt liquor store. Yeah, I had a feeling the full staff and fear been in there, because I know who lives around there. I'm not going to say, because I respect the privacy, you know. But uh, I actually found that location on 40OunceMaltLiquor.com. And... Uh, on the way to the job, I go down into the past there, right past, you know what I'm talking about, the highway. 
back and forth all week, and I'm thinking, man, I gotta fucking stop there and get some shit. So finally, I fucking, you know, had my camera with me. I stopped, made the video. That place has a fucking excellent selection of malt liquor. Actually, 40 ounces of beer, bad beer, malt liquor. Good store. Fucking, they're definitely one of the top ones. I don't know about getting a sandwich out of there. <clears throat> but definitely buy some malt liquor out of there, which I did. I'm very picky when it comes to food. Places gotta be fucking clean. You know what I mean? But man, they get for a fucking malt liquor store, that is the place. Malt liquor. Remember the clocks go back tonight. <clears throat> I'm not back. They go ahead. They go forward. I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm not even thinking. The clocks go forward tonight. So we get an extra hour of daylight. But you lose an hour's sleep in the morning. Which kind of sucks. But it is one step close to closer to spring. And I've been waiting all winter for fucking summer to come, man. You know, been a long ass, ass kicking winter. I'm fucking glad it's almost over. More well, liquor. Now is the time to get back into shape. Start running. Start working out. I always do that every year when the clocks go forward. It's when you know spring's there, so. I'm gonna have a strict fucking, uh, I've been hitting the gym, working out a little bit, you know, doing a little running, just stretching the muscles, the legs and everything, you know, because now it's gonna be full fucking force, dude, with a strict diet. This diet has to include malt liquor, because, <clears throat> If it doesn't include malt liquor, your body will just turn into shit. You have to include malt liquor in your diet. Malt liquor. Don't forget that. Very important. Very important. Two of these, a couple hurricanes, uh, Mickey's, Mickey's Ice, which is an ale, we all know that, but I never had a Mickey's Ice, so I figured I saw it there, I'm like, you know what, let me grab one and see how it stands up next to uh, the Ballantines, I gotta try that out. I already slammed one of these and a hurricane off camera because I just enjoyed malt liquor and I just didn't cam up. So I figured, let me cam up with a double malt and uh, all my big bears. The big bears I already had, they just look good in the, uh, the picture with the fucking, with all the different malt liquors with the big bear background. They fucking look fucking epic, man. Fucking malt liquor up the ass. That didn't sound good, man. Not like the rules, that faggot in the beginning, you know? You're gonna play hide the Russian salami with country chef beer boy, you fucking tool. Go fuck yourself. Though about fucking me fucking myself. Fuck you. More liquor. Mm. And also... Dorf. Got 
some advice for you, man. If you're really good friends with Super D, do him a favor, okay? Do not... Well, first of all, I'm not going to call you a cunt because, you know what, I'm not going to get into that. Everybody knows you're a cunt, so I'm not even going to bring the subject up. But if you are really friends with Super D, don't do the electrical wiring in his Camaro because you will fuck it up just like you fucked up the Boeing 787 fucking electrical wiring and make that shit be grounded while people are out there trying to get home to their families on holidays and they're grounded because of an electrical thing because you fucked up and now of course they're saying it's a battery problem but we all know it was fucking Dorf 68's fucked up electrical wiring I'm sure you had something to do with the 777 that went down recently too to, you know you, you can't run wiring through doors, so when they slam the bathroom doors, when they go in there to take a shit, they pinch the wiring, and... Y y y uh, you Google it. It's on Google. Go Google the, uh... Boeing 787 Dreamliner, and it says Dorf 68 fucked up the wiring. It says it right on there. Google it. You'll see. Malt liquor. Because if Dorf does the electrical work on Super D's Camaro, Super D is going to have a super dead car on that beautiful Sunday morning when he wants to take his ride out. I think he's going to be fucking pissed at Dorf. So, don't do the wiring on Super D's car. some serious malt liquor business. I'm allowed to say it. The rules is not. Serious malt liquor business. Malt liquor. <laughs> Fuck you rules. Just a piece of shit fucking Russian scumbag and I own malt liquor business the saying you know what I'm saying so if you ever fucking say it again I'm gonna get a Russian Jew lawyer and I'm gonna sue the fucking shit out of you so don't you ever say it again believe me no offense to Russians we all know what's going on in the world today. I'm not. This isn't a political fucking channel. We know what's going on in Russia. But you're a Russian fucking douchebag. Malt liquor. Not to mention the Boston Marathon thing. <coughs> You fucking assholes are just a fucking bunch of... But you know what? I gotta say, uh, in Brooklyn, there is a big Russian community right by Coney Island. And when you go walking, you know, over there in the summertime, the fucking women are looking fine. They could stay. But all you guys... Get the fuck out of here, more liquor. Especially you rules. I know why you're here. Why are you in the United States? You think you fucking Russian country so good?
45 double malt. I got this in Newark about, had to be about a year ago. But that was a 24 ounce can. <sighs> Getting the Colt 45 double malt in the 40 is just fucking intense, man. I can't say how happy I am I found these motherfuckers. And I will be back at that store, King Mart, because <laughs> they have the best selection. Not the best, but very fucking good selection. I guess you could tell I've been pounding some shit already. <laughs> but it is what it is. And right now, it's more like it. Shit, 16 minutes, man. This is gonna be one of those long fucking videos. But you know what? I don't give a fuck. If you're still watching, that's great. <sighs> swill, swill, swill of the delicious double malt. Look at that. Look at that label, man. Fucking cap. I don't know. I, threw, I don't even know where the fucking cap is. Even the cap's got a good fucking label. I'm telling you. Malt liquor. This is the last one I got. I'm gonna have to uh, stop back at the King Mart, visit them again for another round of malt liquor. There it is. Rules, go fuck yourself fucking douchebag. Get the fuck out of here.